ambassadors in situ are high-ranking diplomatic officials, given this title usually in recognition of their selfless service to nation-building as officers of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and the nation at large. In line with the directive of President Buhari, these awardees were handed their letters of commission. Speaking on the essence of the ceremony, the Honorable Minister lauded the support of President Buhari's administration, stating that it gives workers hope and restores their confidence that their hard work will always be rewarded. I really rejoice with, uh, with all of you today. It's taken some time, uh, I know, but um, better late than never. The Ministry uh, is very proud of uh, each and every single one of you and uh, extends uh, heartfelt gratitude for all the excellent work that uh, you have done uh, over so many years. The recipients of the Letters of Commission Ambassadors Institute could not hide their excitement, calling it a great day. Speaking on the conferment, one of the recipients, Ambassador Aminu Lawal, thanked God for the opportunity. He explained the role Nigeria plays on the foreign scene. We thank Mr. President for accepting to confer on us this ambassadors, all the country in the South, uh, West African South region are looking uh, at Nigeria as a leader. In the African uh, continent, Nigeria is the strongest economy. And uh, in the world, Nigeria has contributed immensely in the development of the United Nations. The newly commissioned ambassadors had this advice for workers in various sectors of the country. I tell those of them who are still serving the country to put in their best. Because when you work for the country, think people don't see. Even if anybody sees, God in heaven sees you. Do your best and leave the rest to posterity. Uh, my advice to anyone working in the public service is that do your level best for your fatherland and ensure that you live within the tenants of that institution where you are working, regardless of whether someone sees it or not. The event, which was well attended by family and friends of the recipients, was filled with so much excitement and congratulatory messages. It ended with a group photograph with the minister and the newly appointed Ambassadors Institute. Uloma Oyimachi, ITV News, Abuja.